Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me again. Um, today is a... Today is a good day. Today is always a good day, but today I want to show you guys something. <coughs> I want to show you guys a part of my life that I never really like to show um, to you guys on the internet. And uh, it's somewhat personal because, you know, it's my home. But this is my old house that I used to live in. And uh, I'm still here taking care of it until my uh, new buyer moves in next month. And I want to show you guys a little bit of it and a little bit of the history of it. And it's really sad when I walk into this place and be like, man, you know, this is where I, this is where I left my parents' place and started my own life. You know, it's very sad, but it's very a uh, happy place here. But it's good to see how far you come. I guess that's the way to put it. So this place here is a mobile home, mobile home trailer park. Um, I bought this from my brother when he moved out back in 20, 20, <coughs> at the, at the, at the middle of 20, at the end, at the fall season of 2013. Now I'm going to give you guys a little history before I give you guys a tour of this place. So stay along for the story. So back in 2013, being a young, crazy, nutty, new, having a motorcycle, I was like, man, I'm going to go ride the world. And, um, <coughs> a couple weeks or after I, 2013 was when I rode my motorcycle down to San Francisco, California, Sacramento, my home state, my hometown. And when I came back in 2014, or when I came back the next year, 2014 was when <coughs> my brother was going to move out because he found a new place. And my mom was like, hey, new, you need to go buy your brother's place and go start your own life. And that's when I purchased this place for my brother. And this is when me and Mal, we just moved in here. We weren't married at that time. We just we just moved in here. We told I asked her mom and we or we spoke with her parents. Like, hey, we're gonna go live on our own now. Um, we'll see you guys in a bit. You know, <laughs> so we moved here. Me and Mal, we moved here, and uh, we pretty much just started our own life. You know, this is when we first had our own bills. Oh, we gotta pay rent, electricity, utilities. And this is where we started everything. And then we didn't we, had, we didn't have our first kid till 2020. So 2014 through 2020, uh, you know, a good six years. Me, it's just me and her, six years here by ourselves until we had a little one. So, and then finally this year we sold it and we got something new. But it's just a very, um, it's just a very sad place. Now, I'll be honest, guys, this place is not pretty. And sometime I look at it and be like, man, this is my home. This is my home here. So without further ado, let me show you guys my uh, my old house here. All right, my old trailer park. At the front entrance <coughs> behind the curtain, that's where the main doors is. <coughs> These uh, personal items here are my buyers. He left it here because he's from out of state. But this is where you'll walk in. Uh, this is where we did our cooking videos and we cook right here our very small kitchen this is, was our table right here it was always very hard to have people come over and have a good dinner because our place was so small we didn't have a full-size dinner table um, here's our fridge our stove this is the shoe rack we usually had this over here by that window but yeah this is our place you know it's crazy how we live here we left the microwave we left all the appliances for the new buyer <coughs> yep this is it this is our cabinets um we i turn off all the power and electricity and heat so um there's the water's like frozen right now there's no water no power this is it right here this is where we had our videos if you guys ever watch our eating videos you guys might have recognized some of the backgrounds here um these painting down here were all done by mal mal loves to paint so my wife, she painted all that. And if you can guess, yep, she painted that too. So this is it. It's a very small, <coughs> not super tall, not super high or anything like that. Uh, we put this new carpet right before we had Lincoln. So right before we had Lincoln, we put new carpet just because. And it's still decent. You know, it wasn't the best carpet, but... Just something affordable. 
We added these curtains right here because um, this place doesn't have a good insulation. So whenever the heater's on, it'll just bring in cold air from the door. So we added these curtains just kind of block off some of that draft. Um, this right here is where I put all my CCTV medicine cabinet, the Wi-Fi router, CCTV in the living room, watch the kids and stuff. We didn't take this mirror here. We left the mirror, but I guess Mal bought a new one. I left this photo. There's some photos that I left here because I don't need them anymore. So hopefully my new bar can do something. But this is the living room, guys. This is our living room. And this is where we had our, <coughs> our family time. We, our TV needs to be mounted right here. A little small 30-inch to 40-inch TV. And now we just bought a new 65-inch at our new place. So this right here will be the walkway. Uh, walkway to our place. And this is the door to get outside. And then right over here is where my office happened, guy. Hold on, it's kind of blurry here because it's losing focus. It's very dark. So right here is where all the nutty new media content happened. Hours and hours of creating content. <coughs> man, this room is so... This room belongs in a museum, man. This is, this is where I... Hold on, it's blurry here. Sorry, there's no light. This is where I created all my content, or at least I edited it. This is where the magic happened, guys. If you guys ever thought that I had a little nice studio, and I wish you guys thought it right, but this is where all my video productions, or at least the editing, at least. I don't ever film too much in here. It's a bit blurry, guys. So right here is my old desk. <coughs> you can see where my iMac needs to sit used to sit right here and then um yeah this is where i have my that desk needs to be right here but i bought all new and all new furniture for my office for my new office but yep what a crazy crazy man i can't believe man you know people think that they need the best camera the best gear to create content i can tell you guys right away you don't need that you can use whatever you have and start wherever you can man this is where i started man if you guys think i had a little nice studio and fancy stuff yeah i got fancy i got fancy equipment but you know most of all my popular video was just basically shot on a freaking iphone sorry about that <coughs> this wall here is where i painted it i painted this wall all gray so it's keep blurring out Crazy camera, stop blurring out. Sorry, right here. Yeah, I painted this wall gray just so it's a nice neutral color for a background when I film myself. Like, if you guys watch my reaction videos, you guys notice that background. And we're, we're gonna try to go over here with it without being so blurry. Sorry about that, I had to restart the camera. So right over here, you know, we have the bathroom. We have a very small bathroom, it's crazy. Our new bathroom is like three times the size of this right now, and we never had a uh, we never had a washer and dryer, so whenever we need to do our laundry, we always had to go to a laundry mat. But now we have a washer and dryer. But this is it right here. Um, toilet, very small bathroom. You know, it was always really hard to be in here because when Mal's in here doing her stuff, and I got to squeeze in to do some things, and I got to squeeze the kids in. It's always really hard, but it's nice that we have a nice long bathroom now. Uh, like I say, about three times the size of this. But this is it right here. Nothing pretty. If you guys think it's pretty, it's not that pretty. So that's it right there. This place does need a little remodel, retouch up. And uh, our buyer, he understands all that. He took a look already. So he understands all that, so. And so this is a two bed, two beds, one bath only. I forgot to mention that. And this is where the master bedroom is. This is where um, my wife and I, we slept. And also where our kids slept. So you guys can see where it's pretty small for us us now, right? I might have to come back and take that off. <clears throat> but this is where we share our bedroom with all the families and all the kids. Lincoln always sleeps at the corner. So we had our bed, <laughs> we have our bed flush to this wall and that wall. And he always likes to sit over, sleep over there. And then I think I sleep over here. And then Mal sleeps right here. But yeah, it's a very small bedroom. 
my office, um, my office in my new place is like the size of this room now. So it's crazy how much bigger we got. So this is it. Very small. Nothing fancy. It's a very low, low ceiling too. You know, it's only like what? Eight, nine feet high. This is Mal's closet right here. This is where she has all her clothes and stuff. It's pretty much it. <laughs> Some Christmas wrapper. And uh, we didn't take any of this because we have so many already. So we'll just leave it here. Or leave it here for the new guy or he can decide he wants to throw it away. But that's pretty much it, guys. So I know, man. I never really like to show you guys my house because you know it was it was always like oh you know it's not pretty you shouldn't show it to the world but I guess it's good to show it for the record and maybe in the future I can watch back too so you know always remember where you started and uh, be humble be thankful I have and I have good neighbors too all my neighbors are really good people. A lot of my neighbors right here, they're all like relatives or they're related to each other. So they're always fun. Like the crazy thing they'll do is like just karaoke on the weekends. But other than that, everybody watch out for each other. So I always like my neighbors. Good neighbors. Always good to have good neighbors around you and such. So this is it. You guys can see a very small place. My old pad. Yeah, never had people over much, never had family dinner much because, like I said, it's just so small. You know, it's really crowded when you have more, like, than, more, like, more than, like, eight people over. So, this is it. If you guys don't, I don't want to show you guys the backyard, but, or the front yard, but that's where I do all my Toyota stuff. I used to always work outside on my Toyotas, <coughs> part out vehicles outside. You know, it's just so crazy to see things happen it's just unreal so this is it right here guys just want to just film a little bit show you guys a little part of my life my personal life and stuff i don't think i'm gonna film myself or i don't think i'm gonna give you guys a tour of my new place i don't think i'm ready to share that with you guys yet so maybe in the future um i'll film my new place for you guys for now you guys just see my garage <laughs> My wrenching garage, my man cave, but other than that, I don't want to share anything else for you with you guys yet. And uh, don't don't take that, don't be offended. It's just when I'm ready, I'll show you guys. Just right now, I'm not ready to show you guys my my new place. So, so this is it right here, guys. Hope you guys enjoy, and always make sure to uh, dream big. Catch you guys next time. Much love. <laughs>